Welcome to VEC News, the video channel for industrial cleaning applications. My name is Wolfgang Wieland. Today I brought you the VEC trailer S4. The S4 is a vacuum unit which is designed mainly for bulk material applications. The S4 is a very compact unit with its total weight of just above 2 tons and the height adjustable tow bar. It can easily be transported to the work. It has a diesel engine of 44 kilowatt, which generates an airflow of 2,100 cubic meters per hour and a working vacuum of 500. Typical applications for the S4 are extraction of bulk material from the ground. For example, in coal-fired power plants, in cement plants, in other construction material plants, but also applications where blasting material lies on the ground and needs to be extracted as fast as possible. The S4 is equipped with a coupling for cars and can be towed with a transporter or as shown here with a small truck. This type of vehicle is normally available in most companies. Today we brought you about one cubic meter of gravel and we are going to show you how this material can be extracted by using a DN110 meter long suction hose. As you can see Manuel has already mounted the suction hose to the unit. This is a suction hose in DN100. The unit itself is equipped with a suction inlet in DN125. Therefore, we always require a reduction from 125 to 100 if we want to use a DN100 suction hose. The unit is now in the transport configuration with a collection container in the lower position. Manuel will now use the hydraulic lifting device to bring the container in the working position. The unit can be started by using the electric control. Just like a normal car, the key is turned in the preheating position and then in the second position the engine is turned on. By using the manual manifold, the RPM is then brought to its working RPM. And now we are ready to work. Manuel will show you now how effectively suction work can be done with the S4. about the S4 is how easy it is to change the suction tools. By opening the handle piece, one suction tool can easily be taken out and another type of suction tool can then be mounted to the handle piece. possibilities to discharge the S4. We can discharge the material on the ground, we can discharge the suction material into open containers or we can fill one cubic meter big bags. can also discharge the suction material into big bags. We have already attached a one cubic meter big bag to the S4 and Manuel will show you now how the suction material will be discharged. In terms of 
maintenance, we are still part of the cover which can easily be opened. Finally, we do that for us now. And you can see behind the cover the 44 kilowatt diesel engine, the electric control, the diesel reservoir with a capacity of approximately 60 liters, the filter separator with a collection container at a slower part, we have here the suction inlet and below the suction inlet the filling level probe which limits the collection capacity to approximately 500 liters. Above the suction inlet is the main filter with a pneumatic air shock filter cleaning device. At this position is the hydraulic lifting device in order to bring the collection container from its transport position to the working position. Here you can see the rotary piston vacuum pump and above the vacuum pump the safety filter in order to protect the vacuum pump. If there should be a hole in the main filter the dust will not come to the vacuum pump but be separated, be, will be stopped by the safety filter. And here you can see the battery with the main switch of the unit. The job is done, the heap of material is gone and the S4 can go on to the next job. Manuel, thank you very much and we'll see each other at the next video.